Okay, now 10th problem of exercise 10.2 on straight lines. Find the equation of the line passing through the point minus 3 comma 5 and perpendicular to the line through the points 2 comma 5 and minus 3 comma 6. You have to find the equation of a straight line passing through minus 3 comma 5 and it is perpendicular to the line through the points 2 comma 5 and minus 3 comma 6. If you try to analyze this diagram by means of a diagram, let's first draw the points 2 comma 5 and minus 3 comma 6. Say this is 2 comma 5 and this is uh, minus 3 comma 6. Now there is a straight line like this. You want to find the equation of the line passing through minus 3 comma 5. It is passing through which point? Minus 3 comma 5. So this is, let's say this is minus 3 comma 5. And how it is passing? Passing perpendicular to this line. Okay. So in order to simplify the figure, you can just draw it like this. There is a join of 2 comma 5 and minus 3 comma 6. Now the required line passes through minus 3 comma 5 and how it is perpendicular to the line. Okay. So this is the required line. Let me abbreviate it as RL. What is RL? You want to find the equation of that line. That is called as required line. What are the characteristics of the required line? Number one, it is passing through minus 3 comma 5. Can you see that? The required line passes through minus 3 comma 5. And second characteristic is that it is perpendicular to perpendicular to the line joining 2 comma 5 and minus 3 comma 6. Now this is the most important problem because the principle involved in this problem, solving this problem is utilized for many other problems. What I do is, I will find the slope of this baseline and the required line is perpendicular to You know that if two lines are perpendicular then the product of the slopes is equal to minus. minus. So I will get the slope of the required line. Once I get the slope of the required line, I will use slope at 1 point. Okay. Uh, let me call this line as AB. Okay. Now slope of line AB. Formula is y2 minus y1 divided by x2 minus x1. I will take the point A as x1 y1, the point B as x2 y2. Now using the points x1 y1 and x2 y2 to write the slope of AB, y2 minus y1, 6 minus 5 divided by x2 minus x1, minus 3 minus 2, x2 is minus 3, minus x1 becomes minus 2. So this is 1 over minus 5 or minus 1 by 5. What is the slope of AB? Minus 1 by 5. Now, since the required line is perpendicular to AB, then, then its slope which slope, required line slope, is equal to 5. Why it is 5? Negative reciprocal. Because M1, M2 equals minus 1. Here you have M1 as minus 1 by 5 into M2 equals minus 1. Therefore M2 equals 5. That means the slope of the other line will become the negative reciprocal which is equal to 5. The negative reciprocal of minus 1 by 5 is? Now, point on line 
point on required line is x1 comma y1, which in this case is minus 3 comma 5, and slope m is equal to 5. So what formula you will use now? Using y minus y1 equals m into x minus x1. y minus 5 is equal to if y1 is 5 equals m is also 5 into x minus x1. x minus of minus 3. you find you get the answer five x minus five plus twenty is equal to c so five x minus five plus twenty is equal to c